So, about dipping birds. Look, we've <laughs> been over this time and again. Look, you put a little cup of water by the dipping bird, and when he goes down, he gets some of like, the water on his beak. And when he comes, like, he gets energy from the water, and then the, the liquid, that causes the liquid to flow to the, the bulb that's on his butt. And so then he lifts up, and then as the water evaporates, that cools down the top bulb, which then, like, the gas in it, uh, sh so is he, shrinks and draws the liquid like up into the head. Is it like a siphon? Is it is it like capillary action? How does the water get into the beak? No, the, the water is already... Like, the, the, the working fluid is just in the dipping bird. And then the water just touches the beak. And, uh... Like, changes in temperature inside it cause the fluid to move back and forth. Hmm. You should write a treatise concerning dipping birds. I'm gonna name my son Dippin' Bird. Dippin' Bird. D. Bird Rollins. Key, 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 key. I wanna isn't eat a, a picnic lunch. Isn't there a basketball player named Bird? Or is it a baseball player? There's Larry Bird was a basketball player. Larry Very famous. Bird, so yeah. like Larry Bird and his son Dippin' Bird. This dude needs a picnic lunch. And this little uh, son of a bitch wants a skip sandwich. As we uh, have thus far omitted to note, we are on episode 28. 28. The age of supermajority. If you watched one of these episodes per day through the entire month of February, it would take you the entire month to get this far. And let me say, fuck leap years. I'm not leap the time, not for, nor the patience. When was the last... Was 2012 was a leap year? Yeah. Was it? Yeah. Okay, so we're we're good. Nobody's gonna remember, remember any of this three years from now. That's right. So. In three years, we'll all be dead. Well, the best of us will. You will. As my plans come to fruition. Yes! Give me... A picnic lunch. Let me just peel you off a couple hundred dollar bills off of this $36,000 Philly roll. Lady, it's really none of your business who's gonna carry this, alright? Just give him the damn lunch. <laughs> don't ask me any questions, I'm just here for the picnic. I don't even really need the lunch, I just need the bag. <laughs> you don't sell bags here. So I see you got one old bag working behind the counter. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I'm retarded. As you, as you take eighteen thousand dollars. <laughs> oh, st this mole is about to get fucked up. Oh, he didn't know what's coming. Ooh, one hit point of damage. Blah blah. Isn't- aren't we in a, a place- wasn't this many, many hours ago when we were in this place? Yeah, it- before it was running away from us, but I just- it, it just lost its will to live, and it- <laughs> Let me go in the hole! That's what he said. To her. Oh. She replied in the negative. <laughs> Crippling social commentary. Here on episode 28 of It's All Cold Glass. Of the patriarchy. What? Uh, so what is our mission? We, uh, uh, we exited the Twilight Zone. And now we're, uh, did we ever resolve all that stuff with why is Pokey the CEO of a large corporation? And... No, when we got back from Moonside, we were accosted by a lunatic who told us that the, the sage who was here before sitting on his ass doing nothing uh finally like he said he sent for us basically hmm and uh why did we have to defeat the statue Ooh. 
the money money statue is some kind of source of evil. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna go interact with it. And, no, wait, it's a lan it's a lantern. It's a chest. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. Fuck me, is that a wet towel? Damn! <laughs> hey, Rob Z, uh, you can be the, uh, guardian what? of the wet towel. This incredibly significant <clears throat> wet towel. Wet towel! Uh, c can I just have the box instead? That was, you know... Oh man, I got mad protein drinks. Why do I keep hearing chirping? Uh. Gulp, gulp. Was there a bird in that towel? Bliekiki. Gulp, gulp. Bliekiki. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> translation bot. <laughs> uh. It's a dry <gasps> towel. Oh! Ugh. A chest <laughs> hamburger. But we. We we've, we've seen that before. <laughs> I mean, we haven't had the wet towel before, sure, but well, uh, Mrs. Uh, Bubblegum monkey. monkey. Yeah. Meow meow. Uh, what? No, that's not the sound monkeys make at all. <laughs> the monkey says. <laughs> Coo coo pee pee pee. Uh... <laughs> Why are you telling me this? <laughs> <laughs> if I eat an egg, I may recover some health. Well, great. <laughs> Here, eat this. Uh... <laughs> Good Whatever work, I guess. Say, man. I don't have a ruler. I can already tell that I hate this. As, as you were reading that, I was tapping a ruler on my hand. Shove the ruler through your monitor in order to give it to me. Okay, hold up. Pizza. It is a 15-inch ruler. Which Why? is equivalent to just over 38 centimeters. Why is it slightly longer than a standard ruler? And I have a pizza. God damn it. You of all people, I mean, aren't you the one who bought three different sizes of ruler? I have two different sizes of ruler. Shut up. What two sizes of ruler do you have? I have two small six inch rulers and one one foot ruler. Hey, a pizza! Well, I have, I have a lot more rulers than you do, so... I'll keep that in mind. I have ru rulers for all kinds of situations. I have... 12 inch rulers, 15 inch rulers. I have a 6 inch ruler. I have a, a couple of T squares. I have a uh, angle, uh, a right angle that has a ruler on it. Mm hmm. You know, all kinds of measuring paraphernalia. I love. Me oh! Yeah, that's right. Mm. That's right. That's Don't right. Touch it. Open. Yeah. Whoa. A ruler! That's exactly what we needed, huh? A ruler oh. and a burger. Blap. I can I can tell you in in the affirmative though that I am having a lot more fun right now than I was at any time in Moonside. <laughs> Doing this ridiculous fetch quest part of this game. It's barely even a fetch quest. It's like the, the totally asinine maze. <laughs> it's like, go into the next room. Okay, that's what I needed. Yes, I have... In my father's house are many hamburgers. I go to prepare a hot dog for thee. I'm pretty sure that's the Bible. It's in the Bible. A flame pit. Can't argue with that. Hot damn. What is a flame pendant? And how do I get more of it? 
All right, protects you from fire attacks. Sounds good. Didn't you? Didn't you have a lightning pendant? I have the Franklin badge. What? Oh. I think we found the janitor's closet in this hellish maze. Please throw away your trash on the way out. A broken tube. Great. Uh, a a tomb? What kind of tomb? You have to be a little more explicit than that. Is there some it's... piece of is there some piece of PVC pipe in here? Shut up. Ugh. Crap. I have to start getting rid of garbage, but like, there's no there's no way of telling what these scumbag monkeys are gonna want next. That sounds weirdly racist. In <laughs> you know, part of the problem is all all the items in this game are all sort of the same type. You know, it's like you have types of food and sort of everyday objects, but you don't you never really know what they're gonna do. Yeah. Or, I mean, why, why would that the the hamburger do what the hamburger does, and the? Oh. Well, uh, th this dude's got fresh eggs. Oh, great. Hey, I'm, I'm, let me hook you up with a a egg health recovery monkey <laughs> in the other room. Can I How just... you all haven't met each other here down in this hole yet is a mystery to me, but hey. Shut up and give me the egg. 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 Let's go! So this guy has infinite eggs. We have found the font of infinite egg. And I think the key here is that we're gonna have to haul ass to get back to the egg monkey before that fresh egg turns into a chicken. Or a chick. What? Okay, don't fight that. Just, just get... Ah. Around. Good. I'll go around. That was intact. Oh, good. Yeah, these things cannot even pretend to front. All right. Okay, cool. Uh, good. Still got a fresh egg. Let's do this. I wish there was some way to pasteurize this egg, so it won't turn into a chick. That's what I'm saying. Uh... By the way, we're about 15 minutes into this episode, and it is 11.08. Okay. So, do I have another pizza? I do have another pizza, because I don't want to talk to you, pizza monkey. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Don't talk to me. I need to speak to my business ape about a fresh egg. Ah, uh, I'm a business ape. Handles all the all my egg fresh egg needs. Yes, take this fresh egg. <laughs> That's not the sound you make when you eat eggs. This woman needs a ruler. Yes, I got it, honey. Girl, I got a ruler for you. No! Oh, hey, oh. <laughs> Who the hell do you think you are? Oh. <laughs> oh, great, more tubes. A neutralizer! That sounds like a euphemism <laughs> for some kind of shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> what does it do? It neutralizes! <laughs> Duh! Oh. One of my friends can use the teleport. A king banana- oh. You're a whore, a and I hate you. What the hell is a king banana? A king-sized banana. Not edible. <laughs> Great. I have nothing to say with about what's going on in this game right now. Hey! Um... Protein drink! Play, played any other interesting games over the past week? Uh, I played, uh... Played some The Hunter today.
with a friend of mine from Sweden. That's pretty cool. Were you the hunter or the hunted? Uh, it is only possible to be the hunter and the hunter. I shot an elk, and also two deer. Well, that sounds awful. <laughs> Why would you do something like that? So that I could get points. Is the hunter that game? No. I mean, you played this online, right? Yeah, we played it multiplayer. Great, I don't have a regular hamburger anymore. I remember there was a game uh, uh, that was like, it was ha hunting, but it was zombies. Like, like, zombie animals. What? What, what was this just a regular hunting sim that you played? Yeah, it was shoot, oh, okay. go and find animals and then shoot them. Well, that's, that's, that's just about the worst thing I've ever heard. So, I, in honor of the release of the new, uh, Civilization V expansion... Oh, god damn it! Get your pencil eraser now. <sighs> I hate this game. Get your pen no. Do you not have it? No, of course not! We only have like 20 inventory slots. I had to put that shit away years ago. In fact, uh, Naomi might have it. And she dated. No, you, you you got all your. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, the Express brought it. Yeah. You remember what happened. Yeah. Audience, hey! Rewind to ep episode, I don't know. 25 or so, probably. Ugh, crap. Alright, well, hang on. No, I mean... I need you to get a pen it. and a sheet of paper. I have a mechanical pencil and a sheet of paper. Will that work? Uh... Oh, crap. Hang on, we, we actually have to fight these idiots. <laughs> Anyway, Rap. as I was saying, in honor of the new Civilization V expansion, I downloaded the old Civilization V expansion. Nice, because it was cheap. That, that adds, yeah, it like, the last time I looked at it, it was like $30, and now it's like $8. Nice. So, uh, it adds religion to the game, the, which is Wait, kind did, of did, did 5 not have that? No. Alright. I didn't have religion. Uh, I need you to get that pencil and write down right. Or R. Because we need to go in. This this is the last of two doors that we need to go into. I drew an arrow pointing to the right. Fair enough. And I'll write, I'll write an R above the arrow. You're going to make this way harder than it should be. Now uh, write a left below it. Arrow pointing the other way, and I'll put a star above it. I hate you so much. <laughs> uh, right? Me? Got it? I'm gonna draw oh. a dog. Okay. This one. Uh, we only have, it's only three layers deep, so it's not too bad. What did that asshole need from us? Oh, yeah, we have to get our pencil eraser from the... Pen pencil, right, yeah. ...from the company. Also, you might use wet towel to make yourself not flash red anymore. Yeah. Ugh! Hello, phone. I wonder why the chests changed. Why the chests changed. That's difficult to say. Why the chests... <laughs> yeah, no, you know, yeah, that. <laughs> Could not have said so better myself. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh huh. 
I like it. Right. No. Roger Wilco. That was the name of the protagonist in the Space Quest games. Alright! Yes. Take this garbage off of my- No! Oh, I do need a wet towel. Damn it! Sh shut up! The new uh, Civilization V expansion, though, adds a lot, a lot more things than religion. Like it adds a, uh, it balances the game a lot, rebalances it. Like it adds a bunch of units uh, to make. Like before, the uh, riflemen and the infantrymen were like worlds apart. Yeah. But. Uh, so like the uh, but they they added a new unit between there, that's like a World War One infantryman. Oh, what do they call it? The, they call it Gr Great War Infantry. <laughs> <laughs> they have uh another uh they added World War One aircraft. Oh, so cool. you can get like f five planes and stuff now. Um. And a bunch more naval units. Ooh, that's cool. So, uh, now you can actually attack cities with naval units, whereas you couldn't do that before. Like, attack them directly instead of just bombarding with them? Yeah, you can, like, capture coastal cities with naval units. Oh, that's cool. Some naval units. Like, there are particular ones that, that uh, do ranged attacks, and there are particular ones that do melee attacks. And you have to have right, left, right. Right, left, right, is that, is that the code? Yes. Up, up, down, down, or left, right, left, right, B, A, start. R, star, dog face. If that's any clear. Demonstrably not, because I almost just screwed up. Ass. <laughs> right, left, right. R, L, R. Roman I... legionary... Rumble. Now there's a game. Yeah! Hooray! That lame joke happened again. Oh dear. Yo, what up, monkey? He's been waiting for me. Uh, Do we have any garbage we can ditch? What the hell is a neutralizer? It neutralizes. I just explained this, like, five minutes ago. Ooh. That's... kind wow. of awesome. Yeah. Don't throw that away. No. Oh, what the hell does a handbag strap do? Oh, it's a weapon. It's a one-time use thing, though. What? Just throw away a hamburger or something. When's the last time that actually did you any good? Oh my god. The sprinkles of dragon on somebody, they just turn into a dragon. That's terrifying. <laughs> yo, Rob Z, smoke this secret herb, yo. I've probably made that joke a hundred times already. Surely we have not made that joke multiple times per episode. Sir, you doubt me? Uh, I wasn't really gonna go anywhere with that. Brain food lunch! What is it? Yeah. Ugh, yeah, indeed. What is a brain food lunch? Oh, wow. That's a... Damn. I have a feeling we're about to fight this guy since we've all that cool stuff in here. This was destined to happen. Whoa, what? Uh, Naomi ain't here. <laughs> yeah, who's Rufio? <laughs> what about Rob? <laughs> 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 uh, Rob's ship crashed. He's dead. Waffle. <laughs> Ha ha ha!
<laughs> I'm I'm remembering <laughs> I'm remembering a much better series of videos on the internet that's making me laugh. <laughs> so then Picard and go. <laughs> There's a thing called a Frodo man. <laughs> you need somebody to explain it to the Frodo man. <laughs> Uh, uh, terrible. We're just marketing a different product. <laughs> you guys should check out RobMatterMurderOrphans.com. Uh, Post a comment there. Yeah. But send me Post the pizza roll! On that web zone. If you want a pizza roll. <laughs> no. 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 Continue watching this crappy web series. It will make you stronger. Thanks, Doctor Doom. Ah, uh, what do I get rid of? I'm getting rid of this handbag strap, for God's sake. Cup of life noodles, man. What is that? Oh God, he's gonna give his whole spiel again. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck are you talking to? <laughs> what? How did you know that I was guy. gonna meet a guy called Rorvodol? Did you read the script? What's <laughs> that in that monkey's <laughs> hand? Is that the script? He, that guy who does those those videos should review um uh uh hook. <laughs> You know, a lot of a lot of you know. goofy names to mispronounce. Oh, no, I've been see, it'd be awesome to hear see that movie. That movie was like a box office failure, and I have no idea why. I love that movie. <laughs> I watch that movie. You know, well, I do watch it probably at least once a year. You were big into Hook when you were a kid, weren't you? Oh, sure. Well, I was big into pi anything pirate when I was a kid. Yeah, you were into good yeah. things when you were a kid. Yeah, you know, virtuous things. Like pirates! Things a boy can be proud to be into. <laughs> yeah. Like the Boy Scouts, church, and high seas piracy. <laughs> the church of the one-handed saint. Saint oh. Blackbeard. I was in the Boy Scouts, but I was a terrible Boy Scout. I didn't want to do any of the stuff that Boy Scouts did. Cub Scouts was fun, because we basically just played around the whole time. Yeah. And nobody really expected us to do anything. But the, then by the time you aged out of that, they started wanting you to tie knots and do community service, and fuck that. Oh, oh! If anything, I'm trying to destroy the world. Oh my god. Do you hear that? Yeah. Do you hear a fax machine? Once this... Once this monkey goes... Hits 88 miles an hour, you're gonna see some serious shit. Uh, oh! oh. Do, you, do you have this power... Permanently? Oh. Psy teleportation. Uh. Oh. Oh god, tell me you can teleport to any. Oh! Yes! Dude. Oh my god. Where the hell is Winners? Go there. See what that was. I don't remember what that was. Hold on. First, I wanna, uh. Equip all this cool new shit we got. Winters, you knucklehead! <laughs> I wanted those documents on my desk by four! <laughs> all I can think to do is say the exact same thing you did, but with more vulgarity. 
It just... <laughs> Winners, you faggot! Yeah. It's just stupid shit like that. It's like, wow, you're just... You're just a huge asshole. Uh, we should hang on to those life noodles. That's some important stuff. Uh... I didn't get this far in life by being a nice guy. <laughs> I got this far in life by having the damn documents on my <laughs> desk by four o'clock. Uh, yeah, I know it's you, Tracy. I know you're working part-time. For God's sake, just send a dude out. God. Some people's children, man. That reminded me of that... That bit from Blazing Saddles. Oh, hell, I thought I paid you boys to get a little track lead, not to jump around like a bunch of Kansas City faggots. <laughs> what a fabulous film. I have it on DVD and have never watched it. You disgust me. I should. I like I like the movies. Uh, uh, don't tell me. Uh, uh. Oh, what is that guy's name? Mike Judge. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he also did. History of the World Part 1. Yes. And, and uh, Spaceballs. Yes. And The Producers. Yes. Um, Everything you say is true. He has a little mustache. Yes. He has a little mustache. But, uh... Oh, I can never remember. What, what, uh, it has an M in it. Mel... Me Mel Brooks. There's the one. Funny guy, that Mel Brooks. Yep. Have you ever seen The Producers? No. After this, we should watch The Producers. Okay. I don't know how you're gonna watch it. But... I, I, I have it, so... I can watch it. <laughs> Just you watch it and describe it to me. Oh man, if you're in the menus, this is the episode for you. Men the use? No. No. Because you are in. Or maybe menus Irish Spring. You know, menus soap. Uh, damn it! <laughs> Just don't let me get rid of this garbage. Is the, what does the broken tube do? Uh, if it, if Rob Z can repair it and make it into something. Oh. It's, it's well, nap get off. on it, Rob Z. What? We're carrying around all this garbage in our inventory just so you can do something with it at some indeterminate time. Oh, God, I sound like my mother. <laughs> Oi! Alright, let's, uh... I suppose you, you never had that impulse to, like, collect garbage. I did when I was in high school. Keep, keep it around. Like, you find, you find, like, an old desk or something that somebody's throwing away, and you're like, well, I can, I don't know what I can do with this. I can, oh, it's Rob Z's, it's quote, home, unquote. The old Hizzlebiz house. I want you to I want go there Naomi so back. I can get him home. This is a real, real sausage fest, all of a sudden. Yeah, should we go back and... Should we roll back to Foreside and see if we can get her back before we move on? Well, do, do we know where to go? She's still in Foreside. I'm pretty sure. We need to do something about, like, Mr. Modicelli or whatever. 
Oh, well then we're probably not done there yet. Yeah. What the? Um, excuse me? Oh, you, there's a, uh, a ledge in the way. So you burned up. Uh, I guess you, you became have to... a chocolate man. Ah, oh, crap. I guess you have to actually find, like, a, a strip of land wide enough to get going. You got melanosis. There we go. Oh. On a, a runway of sufficient length. Alright, let's go talk to the hint guy. He always knows, and we always, we have a absolutely staggering wad of cash to throw at him. We'll get some hint guy hentai. Ugh. I've probably made that joke 50 times by now. I don't think you have yet. That's it's horrifying. Oh, there's a whore in front of the yogurt building. I mean, the modded... Shut up! Just Horrifying. shut up. Ugh. Ugh. Goods. Use. You're so kind, I'll make... Okay, sounds great. I need to get to the 48th floor. I find it very... We haven't had Naomi for a long time. Yeah. Why does you know, the game persist in stealing her from us? It seems odd that the game would make us go through, through so much of, of it without one of the... I mean, with a, a impaired party. Yeah. Which... By the way, let me check our time. Only okay, you well, we're, in a, we're at about 30 minutes now. I think there might be a boss fight about to happen, so let's... If there let's is... Do it. Let's do it. Let's see what let's see what's about to happen. I mean, I, I kind of want to look through and and yeah, see what what the deal. What is, is that? Okay. okay, there's Rob. Uh, Johnny Five. Century Robot. I guess I should spy on him to find out what he's weak to. Offense, defense. That robot had a bottle What's... rocket. <laughs> Robots aren't that tough in this world, apparently. No, you just, you crack them, you you pop them one good with a yo-yo, and they go. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. B A. Nope. That was not the secret code. Uh, get him. Take it! Uh. The secret is that's not really a defense robot, it's actually just a vacuum cleaner, and you're incredibly weak. Yes. I, I'm just running around in this office building smashing up Roombas. What's that red and blue room? What does that do? I think those are probably bathrooms, but I'm gonna investigate these small, these other rooms first. Which gender is the red gender? Uh, that one appears to have only one foot in the middle, so I'm gonna say that's probably women. What? Wait, wouldn't it be the other way around? No, because whenever you see, like, a little pictogram, the lady always has a skirt, and her feet come together into, into like, a point, And the man's legs are apart. Because he's wearing pants. Huh. It... Is it like that? Yes. Isotypes, man. Whatever. I'm trying to get this thing to turn so I can slip around behind him. Ha! -ha! Damn it. A B. L A. Uh, wait, no. Shit. I'm trying to remember all the all the secret code, all the codes from uh, Chrono Trigger that you have to punch in on, the, on like the, the face buttons, but I couldn't. Ah, crap. You remember? It, you remember any of them? I remember two of them. X How many years has it? It's probably been ten years or so since I played uh, Chrono Trigger. 
You played Chrono Trigger when you were 16? Yeah, man, I had, I had a SNES emulator. I probably had this SNES emulator. <laughs> yeah. I guess... Ah, uh, okay. Well... Ugh! Why do we persist in this charade, Century Robot? Just fight me and shut up. For that matter, why don't I just step up and knock its freaking block off while it's counting down? This thing isn't Ed 209 or anything. In fact, it's kind of got a glass robo jaw. Alright! Oh, I wish we're getting back to the, uh, standard ha packages. Yeah. None of this gold coffin thing. None of this. Whoa! Was that us saying whoa, or did the box say that when you opened it? I don't know whose reaction that was supposed to be. Maybe the box was alive and we're just like ripping it to pieces and it's like, ah, oh no, ah. We're, like maybe the thing inside the box was just the box's organs and it has a superficial resemblance to a wet towel. Yeah. <laughs> Look, there's a bunch of sausage inside this pig. No, Pokey, that's not sausage. Not yet. <laughs> Pokey, you fool. All right. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, another thing that the new Civilization expansion adds, or the old Civilization expansion now, is, uh, spies. Ooh. So, you can send spies to other, uh, enemy civilizations and steal technologies from them. Awesome. And that's pretty cool. Uh... Hey, it's this lady. Know, th those... <sighs> Enough about this. Give me my girlfriend back. Wait. Look, I'm, I've got $50,000 on my person. <laughs> oh, you're talking... Whatever it is. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were talking to me. I was like, what? <laughs> I haven't got it, man. I'm just a really good actor. Oh. I can't help it. It's a gift. Well, now we have trout yogurt. Great. I I remember when I was in the uh, eighth grade, and I played the dungeon keeper in a play. What? And I won an award for it. What the hell is that thing? Rattle, rattle. Wow. He screamed clank and assaulted me. Oh, clumsy robot. You're just the worst. Tur turn the key on his head. See if that doesn't. That seems unwise. He fired a strange beam! Oh, Jesus. He cleaned the area. Why is he dodging so this, much? This, uh, background seems really threatening. Yeah. You know, you, usually the backgrounds are pretty happy and, you know, kind of just whatever. This one seems really, uh... Like aggressive and angular. Yeah. For God's sake, get hit! Oh, Jesus. Holy shit. Oh, God, we gotta hurry. All of a sudden, some guys. Out of nowhere, a jazz quintet explode into the room. <laughs> Alright, I'm back on board with this game. I was out, but I'm back in. I'm ready. <laughs> oh! <laughs> a chubby saxophonist bursts into the room and fixes everything. Deus Ex. What? Uh, I, I was trying to think of a, a Deus Ex something, too. Deus Ex Woodwindica. Rhymes with 
with, yeah. Well, whatever. Yeah, these douchebags again. Room next I door. I just can't get away from this terrible performance. <laughs> Every time I turn around, I've got season tickets. <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> Open the mailbox, and there's just balcony seats as far as the eye can see. Fuck! It's like it's like the muses really have it out for me. Stop! That's enough! Please! Whoa! What? Hold on. Uh... I don't know if there's... I feel like I should be covering somebody's eyes. <laughs> this vibrating man. Hey, a secret door. Does that is that bear have a controller? So I think he just has claws. Oh, I think it'd be funny if he was holding a controller. Look at my skinny arms and my thin body and gray hair. Mm, I think Mr. Monotoli's coming on to me. How you doing? I'm sorry. Oh. I haven't done anything to her. You going to jail. Naomi. Return to Lars. Beep boop. <laughs> She's not even facing the correct direction. <laughs> I'm, uh, fine. <laughs> yeah. Naomi, you're blind. Well this <laughs> lunatic blinded you. With his filthy old man body. I'm not gonna look body. at you when you. When, <laughs> I'm not gonna look you in the eye when I say this, but just take my word for it. I'm fine. Take some time to listen to him. Ugh. Yeah, I guess I'll spend some time turning this crank. <laughs> it's a rainy day anyway. The hell else am I gonna what? do? What? 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 Uh... What? No, we're not going through that. The Monty Monty statue we've creates an illusion. Wait, didn't we destroy the Monty Monty statue? Yeah. Or possibly a copy of it or something. Mm. I often went there to pray. Cryptic words appeared to me. Men with bows in their hairs and no torso. Don't let them go to Summers, or... What the hell are you talking about, man? <laughs> Gotta guess. At last, Where we're is... getting back to the plot. Where is the pyramid? Have we been to a pyramid? No, not yet. <laughs> no, absolutely not. <laughs> no! Wait! Oh, we're gonna need to ride this dude's helicopter! Wait, we got a teleport ability, and not five minutes later, <laughs> get a, a... Let me show you my helicopter. <laughs> Let me just block the door. <laughs> this man is a rapist. You must go on. Don't touch me! It is your destiny. Take. Fly. This is my helicopter, the air assault of heaven. Do this you know, in remembrance of me. Like, the, the chances that he's actually evil and just trying to get you to fly in his helicopter... Uh, well, I guess not. <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> Alright, check this out. Oh! Oh! <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> I mean that question literally. What are you doing right now? I like how when they, they painted heli on both sides of the helicopter, but on that side, paid no attention to the fact that it was backwards. <laughs> We're only making one sprite for this helicopter, so do a good job. <laughs> this helicopter will really come in handy. Well, bye, I guess. Okay, Lars, you take my other helicopter. <laughs> he took the Pokecopter. You may ride in the Pikicopter. 
<laughs> the hokey copter. <laughs> Pokey took the helicopter. Yeah, you left the keys in it, ass! What? Oh. So what, what about me? How do I get out of here? Oh, look at that ass. She's just a sprite, but the ass was fat. <laughs> uh, can I help? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, fuck this game. Did you, did you just hit the pause button or something? No, that just happened. Oh! Uh. Alright. This is my jam. <laughs> All right. Now you can go in the ladies' room. All right. <laughs> no, there's a problem. Ugh. Someone in there taking maximum dump. Maybe that should be our stopping place. I mean, we are we are probably about forty minutes into this now. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll make a note next to where it says R uh, L R. Get on with it. That we need to go to three. Okay. Next week. That is one week from yesterday. Yes. It's probably after mid midnight by now. Well, it's after midnight for you. Yeah. Not for me. Yeah. So, what was a week ago, one week from now... I lost my train of thought. Just end the episode. Are you going to answer the phone? For... No, no, no. Never mind. Just end...